There are many tools available for machine learning. Here we are trying to present the various tools with respect to the size of the data. If our data is just few lines, we do not require any tools as such. We can simply use whiteboard or pen and paper for both analysis and visualization. But if our data goes beyond few records, we can use MATLAB, Octave or R for analysis and visualization. This is great up to the data size of few megabytes. If our data is beyond megabytes and is within tens of gigabytes, then analysis can be done using NumPy, SciPy, Veka and visualization can be done using Flare, MChart, etc. But if the data goes beyond gigabytes, we would have to use distributed computing libraries such as MLlib for machine learning, Spark R for analysis, GraphX for complex graph processing. The other similar libraries from Hadoop ecosystem are Mahoth and Giraffe. Also notice that there is no visualization tool in case of big data. Why? Because 1. The visualization of such huge data is difficult. Second, it does not make much sense to the human eye. Instead, we first process big data to compute summary and then plot the summary. Let us now understand MLLib. What is MLLib? It is a machine learning library or package of Apache Spark. The goal of this package is to make machine learning scalable and easy. This library has all common machine learning algorithms and utilities including classification, regression, clustering, collaborative filtering, dimensionality reduction. It also provides the lower level optimization primitives for creating our own algorithms. It has the concepts of pipelines to help you create the machine learning workflows. The functionality of MLlib is roughly classified into five packages. The first one is ML algorithms, which has common machine learning algorithms such as classification, regression, clustering, and collaborative filtering. Featureization tools contain the functions to help in feature extraction, transformation, dimensionality reduction, and selection. The third is pipelines. In pipelines, it has tools for constructing, evaluating, and tuning machine learning pipelines. As part of the persistence, it provides the ability to save and load algorithms, models, and pipelines. The saved models and pipelines can be transmitted over the wire or saved to the disk for running in production. The rest of the utilities that it provides are related to linear algebra, statistics, data handling, etc.